All right, the Toronto Maple Leafs with about 14 games left. They're one point up on Florida. Both teams have played the same amount of games. It's a real tight race in the Eastern Conference. You got uh, New York Islanders at 79 points, Florida at 78 points, Rangers at 76 points. In the wildcard spot, you got Columbus at 81, Carolina at 79. The Leafs, I, I really don't give a fuck what they do in the regular season as long as they make the playoffs. To me, this season is all about prove it to me in the fucking playoffs. And it's driving me nuts hearing people in the media or some fans, uh, whichever the case may be, going on and, and talking like Leafs fans are thinking they can beat Tampa. No, no. Don't get it fucking twisted. The only reason Leafs fans, including myself, are saying I'd rather play Tampa is because the reality is you got to play Tampa or fucking Boston. And who's eliminated the Leafs three, four times in, in the last few years since 2013 or whatever the fuck it's been? Boston Bruins. And Tampa has lost Steve Stamkos probably for the first round of the playoffs as well as the end of the regular season. I would much rather take my chances playing Tampa. That doesn't mean I think the Leafs are going to fucking beat Tampa, but I think their chances are a lot fucking better against Tampa than they are against the Boston fucking Bruins because they seem to be a nemesis to the Leafs, especially with the newer Leafs teams in recent years, in recent memory. The most embarrassing fucking things to me are the way the Leafs have lost to the fucking Bruins. I don't give a fuck about losing to David Ayers and the fucking Zamboni driver when you're down 4-1 halfway through the fucking game. Anyways, I don't give a shit about that. It's a meaningless regular season fucking game. Do I wish the Leafs came back against them? Sure. Was it embarrassing? Sure. But to me, the bouncing and eliminations in the playoffs from the Boston fucking Bruins are way more embarrassing to me than losing after you're already behind in a fucking regular season game. I couldn't give two fucks about that. This year is all about prove it to me in the motherfucking playoffs, Toronto Maple Leafs. I want to see you win a round against Tampa or Boston, and I want to see you compete and not blow a third period lead or a 3-2 series lead or any of the other bullshit that's happened in recent years. I want to see if Kyle Dubas's fucking team and his analytics can get it done. And I'm not a hater of analytics, nor am I a hater of the eye test. I think you're a fucking idiot if you don't use both to make your fucking decisions. Because analytics don't tell you everything. Like in hockey, goals against average, sure, it tells you the average amount of goals that that goalie let in o over the season per game, but... Does it tell you where the fucking shots come from? How many were rebounds? How many were two-on-ones? How many were two-on-os? How many were breakaways? How many were fucking five-on-three power play advantages with tic-tac-toe, your defense out of place? How many were because your players were out of position and you're facing 40, 50, 60 shots? I know save percentage ties into that a bit too, but again, that doesn't tell you where all the fucking shots are coming from. How many were deflections in front of the net? How many were screen plays? How many times did you have your stick knocked out of your hand? How many times was one of your players without a stick? So many fucking factors go in to it that other than just the eye test or just analytics. You gotta use them both, blend them together. Sorry about that little analytics rant at the end there, but go Leafs, go. Show me in the fucking playoffs you can do it. As long as you make it in, you'll be third. No worries. I think Florida has no chance. I think you both have a tough schedule coming up. And the Leafs, I don't know whether this is a bright note or a sad note, but I believe six of their last eight losses have come to non-playoff teams. Tonight, they play Tampa Bay. Should be a win, I guess, with the inconsistency and in the way that the Leafs have played this year. So anyways, go Leafs, go. Show me in the playoffs that you can do it. Peace.